Gonna do some damage! Boomtown! Top 5 alliances. That's right, top 5 alliances of Empires and Allies today. It is August 21st, 3.19pm, uh, and here are your top 5 alliances. Some very familiar faces. Uh, Commander... Co uh, they're number 6. <laughs> um, Rise Evil Warlords, Orient Finest, Commander Union, Navy Seals, and ZG. So, we did see, not only is the number 1 player a member of ZG, but Commander Union also had three of the top five players. So we can see some powerhouses of alliances already just by looking at the top five. But what we're going to do in normal fashion is we're going to actually take a look at each top five. Um, we're going to take a look at each of the top five alliances, scroll through their entire alliance, read their uh, description, and go over their requirements and such. So Rise Evil Warlords. War is coming, no stress, and enjoy the game. One flag, one gold would be the best we can as a team. Uh, they are ranked number five. They currently have 49 members, and they uh, require 15,000 medals just to walk in the door and a level HQ of 12. So um, congratulations to NathBeth029444, Gaetan, John Utton, and hi. <laughs> um, for uh, leading up the top five of your alliance, but let's go ahead and scroll through and give all of your alliance some credit for dominating and reaching number five of top alliances in Empires and Allies. All right, and so ending it there with Snake. Um, awesome work here, uh, Rise Evil Warlords. Keep up the good work, and we salute you here on Empires and Allies for dominating the Alliance's leaderboard today. Now let's go ahead and jump into number four, Orient Finest. Currently they are sitting at, like I said, number four with 49 members and a required medal count of 25,000 just to walk in. Uh, they do require a level 18 HQ, and their description is, We want war, not a race for medals. Better if there, was, uh, better if there is an alliance war for a reward, more power Zynga. Woo! Um, I don't really know how to take that. Um, I'm hoping it's a message to me because they know I read their description every week. But um, quite honestly, I want to call something out right here. It says, uh, better if there is an alliance war for a reward. Alliance War. Alliance War. Well, hmm. Could that be Alliance versus Alliance? Which, yes, is being developed right now and is going to be next. Actually, not next. Uh, after we see troop management, alliance uh, management, or troop sharing, and alliance management, and some other features get pushed out in this next update, what you should be expecting shortly thereafter is that big old AVA. Can I get a hoo in the crowd for AVA? Rank number four, Orient Finest. They want Alliance War, and it's coming. Uh, Nicolo Rage, AS00075YYSJ, and DonLau5, and N2S. Congratulations. You are all the top five of Orient Finest. Now I'll take a quick moment and scroll through your entire alliance and give everybody some credit. Some awesome names here. We are always worried about that one of somebody who takes it a little too far and we gotta change it live on the air. That's never a good thing, but luckily nobody was an offender today. Orient Finest, we salute you here on Firepower Fridays. Congratulations for reaching number four of Top Alliances. Let's go ahead and move on. Everybody tell Lecky Beast that I said hello. Everybody, give a shout to Lecky Beast. He's one of our favorites. Anywho, moving up the the leaderboard, folks. Number three in Empires and Allies today is Commander Union. Very excited to take a take a look at this alliance. Um, Commander Union lead with ambitions. Uh, they are ranked number three. They only have 36 members, and they have a required medal count of 18,000 just to walk in. Uh, Dennis Wen, 
IBY, Tycor, Care Cartel 1979, and Robios. That's all. <laughs> Robios, uh, you guys are the top five players of Commander Union. Congratulations. Let's go ahead and now scroll through your entire alliance and give some credit where credit is due. actually satin for anybody who caught that anyway <laughs> and yes we see a moderated username moderated username is the shame that you get for picking a horrible name and us having to change it for you so you don't want that but anyway congratulations to commander union it does look like these are uh, a lot of members from a previous alliance I'm not gonna call them out but it does look like there's been some shuffling so congratulations and Scrat007, thank you for calling that out. And now I have to change that name. Dang it. Okay, folks, uh, moving up the line, line here. Again, Commander Union, we salute you. Keep up the good work. Um, number two, no stranger to the top alliance section of this show. Navy SEALs, uh, lead alliance of Navy SEALs empires. Join Navy SEALs 2, 3, or 4 if short of requirements. Uh, currently, they're sitting at rank number two, have 45 members and a required metal count of 20,000. Um, just taking a look at their top player, uh, top five players, uh, Boo Racer 24, Pats, Jazz Orts, Too Cool, and Malamakai. Congratulations, you all, for leading the pack of Navy SEALs. And now let's take a quick second and salute the rest of your alliance, shall we? So I want to say that my favorite name in this entire group is OMG to Bobby. <laughs> um, congratulations, Navy SEALs. You all are dominating and holding down number two of Empires and Allies. We have seen them at the top in the past, but let's go ahead and now make way for the number one alliance in Empires and Allies with a very solid lead of 1,476,071 medals. We are talking about ZG. And I'm still waiting for somebody in chat to, to translate what this says. Anywho, uh, <laughs> ZG is currently dominating the top of the alliance. Don't know what the description says. Hope it's good. And uh, currently a rank of number one, 48 members, 15,000 medals just to walk in the door, and a required HQ level of 15. Um, just taking a look at their top five players, Arrow. <laughs> and four others are uh, doing a great job. Congratulations, you all. And now let's really quickly scroll through the rest of your alliance and show the rest of your team who's killing it by making rank number one of top alliances. Oh, looks like we have somebody from that famous movie, Meet the Fockers, at the bottom. Yay! Anywho, folks, <laughs> congratulations, ZG. You all have dominated the top of the leaderboard today on Empires and Allies. It is August 21st. It's 3.29 p.m., and these are your top alliances of Empires and Allies today. Uh, we're actually going to scroll through all 50 and just give some credit to those folks working their way up the leaderboard some familiar faces here, definitely like Billionaire's Boys Club. Korea, Korea, Korea. The Korea Clan. The 420 crew. Korea War 
Number one. One Defiance Alliance. Oh, I like that one. One Defiance Alliance. That's pretty cool. And finally, <laughs> Avengers Rise and Dictator Leader. Well, to each their own, folks. Uh, definitely some clever and interesting alliance names. But these are your top 50 alliances of Empires and Allies today. We challenge you to get out there, form an alliance, and start knocking these guys down a peg or two. Right? So that's going to do it for us today for Top Alliances. Let's go ahead and now get set up.